Good morning everyone, this is Bremster, and today I'm coming to you with yet another puzzle from Sudoku U. This one is called Snakes by Mastro Setter and Trip Tup. Um, so yes, um, it's actually been about a week since I recorded the last Sudoku U puzzle. For you, it's a day since you saw it. Um, yeah, this one, uh, of course, Sudoku U series, these are puzzles by the students of Full Deck and Missing a Few Cards as Puzzles and Paradoxes class, um, and I've been I was sent a bunch of them and I'm getting close to the end now. So um, it's always good to, re, uh, to well, not revisit, visit these puzzles. Um, links below to the puzzle as well as to where you can get a whole bunch of the previous puzzles that have been done in this series, the um, Signet Sudoku books. And I'm pretty certain these puzzles will come out in a new Signet Sudoku book sometime soon. Um, whether soon is next week or in three months, I don't know. Um, but when it does come out, I will make sure to let you all know. Let's have a look at Snakes by Mastro Setter and Triptup. So we have normal Sudoku rules. So in every box, in every row, and in every column, the digits one to nine must be placed without repetition. We have crop key pairs. So digits in cells separated by a black dot are in a two to one ratio. Um, digits in cells separated by a white dot must be consecutive and not all dots are necessarily given. So it's perfectly fine for any other pair of cells that are orthogonally connected to have a two to one ratio or be consecutive. And then thermometers. So digits on thermos strictly increase from the bulb to the tip. So this is the bulb and it increases as it goes down this thermo. Um, but as you move along a thermo from the bulb, the digits must increase. So this digit is higher than this, this digit is higher than this, this digit is higher than this. So basically the temperature will rise as we go along a thermo. I'm going to restart the puzzle to restart my timer. Let's give this a shot. So um, I'm tempted to just pencil mark these thermos because these ones in particular look incredibly restricted. And the reason for that is these black dots, because there's a limit to what you can put on a black dot. On a black dot, and I just need to make an adjustment here, on a black dot, um, you must put a low digit followed by an even digit. Um, so one side will always be low, one, two, three, four, and then it's even double because one doubles to two, two doubles to four, three doubles to six, four doubles to eight. Now you may notice from those, you can't continue to five doubling to 10. 10 is not a Sudoku digit, at least not in this puzzle, not a standard Sudoku digit. So um, you may notice from that, that high odd digits don't exist. Five, seven, and nine can never go on a black dot. But because of that, those pairings, um, you can have like two even digits, two and four, four and eight, or you could have two low digits, one, two, two, four, but you must have one, at least one digit from one, two, three, four, and one even digit. So as we move along here, I can say that this is either going to go one, two, it's going to go two, four, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine would work. It can't go three, six. So there must be a two on here because three, six, seven, eight, nine broken and four, eight would be four, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13 broken. So there must be a two along here. This one is just as restricted, possibly more so because I can't put one here because this has to be lower. So it can't be one, two. It could be two, four. And the reason I'm putting them in this order is because this is along a thermo. This has to be higher than this. So I couldn't do it the other way around. I couldn't put two here and four here because then the thermo would be broken. And it was the same here. It had to be the higher digit. So I had to put the doubled digit on this side of the dot. So two, four, three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten doesn't work. This is two and four, meaning this is the one. So this is maximum nine, maximum eight, maximum seven, maximum six. So five, six, six, seven, seven, eight, eight, nine. That's all forced. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine could work if these were one, two, and three, but these can't be one, two, and three, because in this box now, three is in one of those. So I can't put three in any of those, and I can't put three up here, because if I put even three here, three, two, one, zero, it doesn't work. So three can't go in any of those or any of those. That has to be the three, that's the two, that's the one. Four is now in one of those. That's not that helpful. There is no two on that. Or is it this now? Because these were incredibly restrictive, but have kind of run out of steam. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 
Well, one and two, well, this is a one, two pair. Where do I put one, two in this box? I can't put them here because they're seen in the row. There's already in the row. They're already in that row. And I can't put them here because one, zero, blah, 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 two, one, zero doesn't work. This is a one, two pair. This could just be a four, you know? So four is in one of those. Four, three, two, one might work. Three can't be here. So three is up here. Four is here. So four, oh no, four can't be here. Because four, if four was here, I couldn't put four in this box. Four is down here and it can't be four, three, two, one, zero. So four is in one of those two. So this is five, six, seven, five, six, seven only. It can't be eight or nine because if this was eight, nine, 10, doesn't work. This is only five, six or seven. So this is maximum six, maximum five. So this is three or five only because it can't be four. Interesting. So this is four, five or six because it has to be between, um, it has to be higher than three, but it has to be lower than seven. And it can't be four. This is a five or a six, giving me a five, six pair in the row. So this is now more restricted. So this can't be one, two, three. It can be four. It can't be five, six, and it can't be seven because it'd be seven, eight, nine broken. This is the four. And where is five and six in this box? The five, six knocks five, six out of those. That's really cool. So five, six in this box is up here, but I can't put the five in either of those because then I'd need a digit between the four and the five. So this is the five. And now I can't put the six here because there's no digit between the five and the six. That's the six. These are seven, eight, nine. The five makes that the three, which makes that the two, which makes that the one. And these are seven, eight, nine. This is a five, five, six, seven, no. But this, no, I'm just completely wrong about this. This can't be a five anymore because it's got to be higher than that. So six, seven, seven, eight, eight, nine. Because this has to increase as it goes up. Now this pair must, must be four, eight. This is a four, eight pair and we know the order because I can't use one, two. I can't put two on it. I can't use two, four. I can't use two on it. It can't be three, six. I can't put six on it. So this is four, eight. And if this was eight, it'd go eight, nine, 10. Doesn't work. That's a four. That's an eight. Meaning there's no eight there. Eight is in one of those two. So eight is up here. But four here means this is two or three because it can't be one. This can't be five, so this is six, seven, or eight, and this is seven, eight, or nine, giving me a seven, eight, nine triple in that box. So what can that be? It can be one, two, two, it can't be one, two, so it's two, four, or four, eight, and it must contain, uh, no, not four, eight. It's two, four, which it could be, it can't be one, two, or it's three, six. Oh, the eight makes that the nine which means that's not a nine, which means that's not an eight. This now has a maximum of seven. This is two, four, or three, six. That's a seven, eight pair. One is in one of those. This is a bit restricted. It can't be one, two, three, four. It could be five or six. It can't be seven, eight, or nine. So that's a five, six pair, making that seven, that eight, that seven, that six. Which means that's five, because this now sees one, two, three, four, six, seven, eight, and nine. That's a five. Which means that's a six, that's a five which puts six down here, and that's the only place I can put it. Is it this dot now? Because this can't be one, two, 
it can't be 2, 4, and it can't be 4, 8, because 8 is down in one of those two, because I can't make this 8, 9, 10, 0, 8, 9, 10, 11. So 8 is in one of those two. So this can't be 2, 4, 1, 2, 2, 4, or 4, 8. This is 3, 6. 3, 2, 1 doesn't work because I can't put 1 here. This is the 6. This is the 3. 6 means this has to be higher than 6, and it can't be 8 or 9. That's the 7. This is a maximum five, maximum three. So this is two or three only because it can't be one. So this is three, four, or five. But this is a triple now. One can't be two, three, four, five, six, seven, one, eight, and nine. And that can't be an eight or a nine. That's the one. This is an eight, nine pair. So this is the one in the box right there because it can't be in any of those. And this of the three makes that the two. There's no three there, and this is a four, five pair. The two makes that the three. So what can this be, maybe? Because it can't have one, two. It can't have three on it, because it can't have two or four. So and it can't have five on it. So this is from six, seven, eight, nine, and it can't have nine on it because if it had nine on it, it'd be nine, eight, and then this would have no fill. So this is from six, seven, eight, and it must have an odd digit. Six and eight aren't consecutive. So there must be a seven in there, which means there's no seven in those and there's no seven in, in those. Seven is in one of those two. Two is in one of those two. This is a one. One can't be in any of those. That's a one. This is a quadruple. Two, five, seven, and nine. So two, five, seven, nine. There's no seven or nine there. There's no five there. There's no two there. It's actually not really that good, is it? Oh, this one looks up making that the two and that the one. That looks down saying that can't be two, four. This is three, six, and the three makes that the six and that the three. So these are two and four, meaning that's not the four, that's the four. So this, well, there's no seven in those. The eight, nine pair looks across, making that the seven, that the eight, that the nine, taking nine out of there. This is the five. The seven looks across, making that the eight and that the nine. That's the seven and that's the three by the only places they were left in the box. The eight looks down, making that the nine and that the eight. This is neat. Okay. Triples. Because this is a triple. This is just six, seven, eight. Because one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. This is six, seven, or eight. And it can't be the seven because the seven has to be up here. This triple is one, four, five. Because two, three, six, seven, eight, nine. One, four, five. There's no one there. So this is two, three, nine. Seems to be. So two, three, nine. But there's no two there. Not that helpful. It's going to be this. There's no seven there because of that. It is going to be this. So what is this quadruple? So one, two, three, four, five, six. So these are two, seven, eight, nine. Now this can't be two because two, one, zero, yeah, two, zero, minus one, minus two doesn't work. So this is seven, eight, or nine. There's no two here. Doesn't say, well, this is a minimum of two. This is a minimum of four. One is in one of those two because of the two ones looking into the box and I can't put one part way along a thermo. What is this quadruple? One, three, five, seven. Now this can't be a one. Three, two, one doesn't work. This can't be a three. So that's a five, seven pair. This is a one, three. 
And if that's a one because of the five, seven pair, if this is a one or a three, this can't be a seven, eight or nine. So that is the two saying that's not the two. Two is in one of those two. The two works with the one, three, but it means that's not the two. So this is the two. Cool. Okay. Now, five would make this four, five. If this was five, I think we're broken because this these would have to be lower than five, but they can't be one, two, or three. So these would both be four. That doesn't work. That's a seven. There's no seven in those. Those are eight and nine. The seven makes that the five, which makes that the two, which makes that the nine, which makes that the seven. The five looks across making that the four and that the five. The four looks back making that the two and that the four. This column has been mostly complete for ages. It's just missing a four, which takes four out of there. So this is a triple. Four, five, six. These have to be in order. So I can't put the six there or the four there. Otherwise, the high low wouldn't work. And the four here makes that the five. So that becomes the six and that becomes the four. That takes four out of there, takes six out of there. Ah, the seven looks across, making that the eight, because this had to be the seven. This now is the six. The eight looks across, making that the nine and that the eight. It hasn't given up yet. So this row, three, four, five is what I'm missing. And there's a four, five in this column. So that's a three. The four looks up, making that the five, that the four. I could have used the one, five pair for that. Oh, well. So these are one, two, three, four, five. So these are six, seven, eight, nine. So there's a six in one of those two, and that six is saying not there. This is a six. These are seven, eight, nine. There's no seven there. And there's no seven there because of that seven. That's a seven. This is an eight, nine pair. Five is looking across, making that the one and that the five, and that will break it open because the three looks back, one looks over, making that the three and that the one. The three looks over, making that the nine and that the three. The nine looks in, making that the eight, which makes that the nine, which looks down, making that the eight and that the nine. And that is the solution to snakes by um, Mastro Setta and Tripped Up. That was really cool. I liked the break in with the dots on the thermos. And then the Sudoku was fun. Like that was really, really nicely set. And I love the, the layout of the thermos and everything. That was just a nice little fun puzzle. I love these. Really, really cool. And maybe the thermo should have been green because that reminds me of the green lantern symbol. There is better green lantern than the movie. Thanks everyone for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, this was a good way for me to get back into Sudoku after a few days off. Um, yeah, great fun. Thanks everyone for watching. And as always, good luck with your solving.